All right. Wow, the volume got up super unexpectedly. Okay, so we are back on live, and we were on this mission, this uh, supply mission, uh, in the lost city, as we mentioned. It is the one where we have to hurry, which is terrible because I am currently really, really needing some alien alloys, which means we probably have to be on the double. And to do so, we're gonna use this guy as a scout. Not only because he has the Phantom, but because I can also give him a free move. Uh, I don't think we're gonna meet anything on this first move. So that's why I'm gonna double move everyone. We brought the Sniper. Uh, because I think this is the mission where there are some very good balconies. And we can use them to our advantage. So we have already some lost units confirmed, that means we'll need to pay a bit more of attention of where we go. It could be anywhere, like around this corner, effectively. Uh, the fact that they see each other is great for us, um, because they're, they're gonna activate each other, uh, and while we remain in concealment they're gonna hate each other and they're gonna hit each other, which is great for us, since everyone is concealed. Oh, please, no. Oh, yeah, that's fine. Everyone is concealed, that means they don't see me yet. Uh, which means we'll advance with everyone. And take positions over here and over there. Let's see if we can find you. Oh, that's a nice balcony. That's a very nice overlooking balcony. Uh, we'll take that placement over there. And we'll use to move over here. And we'll bring you back a bit. Because we d specifically don't want you to be revealed. Okay, so these guys discover each other. That's always funny for us. And since the Lost get the first turn, that means they'll probably get punched in the face. Uh, we see an extra patrol over here. They'll probably reveal the other guys. <laughs> this, this is great. And everyone will move now. Uh, the great thing is we don't really need to activate ourselves right now. We can just wait one turn or two and see what happens. The Lost will move towards these guys. And begin uh, punching everyone, which is great. Or actually not. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take yet another turn before we reveal ourselves because uh, we want something to happen either these guys shoot all the lost <laughs> or, or reveal their friends yeah i guess that that's a thing oh wow that's amazing uh so either this happens which is terrible for them oh, wow that's, that's such an insult uh, or the Lost start doing some actual good damage to them. And the best thing is they will probably get together for this purpose. Okay, so he got the kill. He gets another shot. That's yet another kill. He can deal 6 damage. That's actually kind of crazy. That's the second move. That means nothing for us. Then there's the Lost who can move again. And probably punch someone, we hope. I don't know. Nope. Okay, so since we still have not revealed ourselves, and they have not revealed themselves to us, uh, we can take another Overwatch turn. Uh, the mission does not really begin until they see us, so this means we now just know where everyone is, which is always a positive thing. Uh, the great thing is that now that they are activated, they won't go to new places, which means if we start shooting at this guy, he's already out of cover. Let's see what this unit decides to do. It's a very good shot. He takes a free action and hides himself. I don't know if we care about that. Okay, that's a counter strike. Wow, everything is very funny right now. So what do we know? We know that there's uh, a Lancer over here, uh, this Mutant here, and three units hiding over here. 
So what we could do is move a little bit further. And then Overwatch. 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 We're gonna wait yet another turn to see what the computer does. I don't know if they'll go hunting for more lost or if they'll just move together again and consider themselves uh, initiated or triggered rather. Okay, so what do we see? We see that these two guys are now clueless on what to do. Uh, we also see that there's one box over here, so we don't really want to destroy the entire structure. But we do want to open up on this side. Why on this side? It's because uh, we know there's three guys over here. But we really don't know how they will react to the news of uh, us existing. So this could go really, really wrong. Or it could go just fine. What do we have here? What are op options? We could also use this guy still to explore. He's gonna remain in cover, in uh, you know, um, shadow, in concealment. There we go. I want to use one action with him. See what happens. I get spotted. I guess this is fine. Uh, we wanted to know how these guys are forming, and now we have all the information. So what do we have over here? We have no vision there. We have a muton. I'm guessing a grenade over here will be great. Uh, I also want to kill a lot of them so that we don't need to uh, drop too many Mimic Beacons. We'll still need to drop one or two for sure. So we're gonna start with the Grenadier, move over here and grenade the whole building. We want to open up a pathway for the sniper to shoot, that would be great. I don't see it really happening, but you know, that's how we start. Uh, I know there will be Lost reacting to this, but uh, that, that's perfectly fine. We're super well equipped to kill the Lost. Okay, so... Okay, something happened and this guy did not get hit. That's actually terrible. He actually kinda doesn't exist. That's even worse. Uh, so I really don't know what's happening there. This guy would only be able to attack once, that's not ideal. Okay, so this is actually not going really good. So what we're gonna do is... Pray. That's exactly right. Um, what do we want to do? I'm really surprised at this guy not being in range of anything. So maybe we took some wrong actions over there. Uh, I could also drop another grenade. But that's not gonna do enough. Uh, I don't see the sniper doing a lot anyway, so we're probably gonna overwatch with it. Uh, I see us moving over there. I see us attacking with the sword, not a muton. Please remember that. You get destroyed if you do this. I do see us taking a shotgun shot though, so let's start doing that. We know of all of these people. We have 70, we have a 66, that's a muton. Wow, oh, these mutons have a ton of health. I knew damage would be a, a tiny problem. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go for the mech. This, was that a miss? Wow, that is, that is super bad. Okay, since we got that miss, well, there's not much more we can do. Uh, I guess we could now attack with Ren to, to this other guy instead. That's exactly what we're gonna do. It's it's even low damage because we're not uh, fully powered yet. But at least we get the parry, and with the parry comes a tiny extension to this mimic beacon that we're gonna drop. Uh, I guess we could get lucky and not get the mimic beacon instantly killed. We could also get lucky and have this sniper kill someone on the way. But this looks really really bad. We really expected this turn to go way better than it did. That's a very nice shot. Nice try. And I hope he misses the melee. That would be nice. <laughs> That's actually not a miss. It's a great hit. Uh, we hope that this goes really, really bad for him. Or he doesn't do anything. I'm also okay with that. The most important units have already attacked. 
Uh, the next most important is the... Oh, that's a miss. That's great. If the mech moves now... Ah, that's a shame. Okay, so I'm guessing this guy dies. Oh, no, it's a three. Ah, oh, this is perfect. Okay, so what happened just now is that all of them were very confused on what to do. And uh, did not manage to kill one illusion in one turn uh, with five people. A lost swarm has appeared. That is perfectly fine. There will be a lot of dashers in it, I guess. But we are kind of ready for this. We're perfectly fine. <laughs> this guy doesn't want to be left behind. That is a box we're absolutely not going to care about. It's a shame, but that's what we have. Okay. So time to start destroying everyone. How can we do this best? We could drop a ton of grenades, but that doesn't really work. We could do... So we could go over here. So... Ah, okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna kill this guy and we're gonna hope he explodes. If he explodes, everything gets easier. Everyone gets t uh, takes a lot of damage and we'll go from there. If he doesn't explode, we'll see what we do. So the question is, how do we make him explode? The answer is gonna be sniper fire. Maybe. Stun lancer, nope. Mutant, nope. Purifier, that would be it. So we can see if we can take a. Ah, I don't really like this. This is the chance where we don't kill it, and. I guess this could have been a shot on anyone else, like for example on this mech. You know what, that's exactly what I'm gonna do. Uh, we're gonna take a double shot on the mech, of course we miss 80%, but what can you do? Please shoot, please hit. Okay, I guess a, a mech at 4 we can kill. Uh, we have this guy with a shotgun, and we can move him over here and take the shot at the at the guy as we mentioned, at the purifier. If the purifier dies, everything becomes easier. Here we go. That is, that is great. That is great. Uh, okay, so we killed two units just by doing that. Uh, the dashers will probably get some hits on us, but what can you do? We're doing our best here. Um, this guy can get a free kill over here. Yes, yes he can. And the other thing we could do is just come up here, get a kill. We could also come up here, get more kills. Is that a thing? Does that work? Okay, so what can we do with you? We can go back. Ah, we need to kill this guy. Okay. Okay, so this there is a path where we ran up here. And I think that's exactly what I'm gonna take. I like this because it keeps me far away from others and uh, it ensures the kill. And we have this tiny problem called uh, mutant that we have to take care of. But I guess we, there, there are some things we can still do. Uh, we have three moves, two actually, if you consider that we're gonna parry. Okay, so we're gonna move over here, or here, actually. I think I like this a little bit more. We move over here, we prepare a dead eye shot, and we check the normal shot. Normal shot wouldn't do it, dead eye shot may do it. So we go with the dead eye. Uh, get him in, it, killed or not, is is uh, it, it doesn't matter how much health he has remaining if he lives. So maybe what we do is. Oh, we have a Mimic Beacon. Okay, so we take the Dead Eye Shot, and we go from there. Boom. Beautiful. Shot work. We're all happy. Uh, now the fun things begin. We have the option of blocking the stairs. And the fun thing about the Lost is that they need stairs in order to go up. They don't have magic jumping. And I absolutely don't see anyone that could get to us if we were to block these stairs over here. Mainly because they would have to run all the way to this guy 
and I don't know if they can see him, so I don't know if they can count him for possible targets yet. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna pray that this works. Alright, up we go. And for you, my friend, can you hit any dasher? That's a brute, that's a dasher, that's a dasher, that's a dasher. Okay, can we bring you to a higher ground? Nope, because we just blocked it. We're very smart. Okay, is there a stair over here? Yes, there is. That's not good. Okay, we don't want to go there. So what we're going to do is we're going to move backwards. High cover doesn't matter. But this is kind of in the middle of the distance. We ignore the brute. We start going for the dashers. We miss. Everything is horrible. That's okay. We expected something like this. The boxes get taken. We're still fine. We need the alloys, but we need living people more. Uh, I don't even know if we already killed all the aliens, that would be funny. But it's a possibility, because the Sigrip said lost, and that replaces some of the pots with the lost. Okay, I didn't see aliens taking a long turn. Let's see what the lost do. The dashers are the dangerous ones. They can probably get to me and attack. That's it's not gonna be good. But you know what? We have so much health. The armor upgrade is amazing. I get a hit for two and it means absolutely nothing in the grand scheme. So what we're gonna do is take some shots in return. Bye bye. Bye bye on you. Bye bye on you. No, that's a miss of 90%. Of course. It's fine. Uh... So we're not gonna shoot there, we're gonna totally shoot here. Anyone with two health, we're gonna kill instantly. And for free. We don't want to shoot there. What else do we have? We have you, you shoot here. Of course we get a five. We have this. Let's see if we can take some pistol shots. Let's kill. That's a kill. And let's see. Uh, sorry for that intermission. I got a call that I cannot take. Okay, let's see. We could shoot here, shoot here. I think we have to kill the brute somehow. So we'll think about that. This loss doesn't really matter. Let's take a shot here. We really want to secure this. Took some good shots. We're gonna just reload and stay safe. And this guy, we're gonna take a tiny shot. This does three damage for sure, so boop! That's a kill. And I'm guessing the mission is close to over. There's still some alien activity going on. I guess it's not the end yet. These guys cannot get in range of me. That's That's amazing. Uh, could I possibly get to this? I think I can and I think I will. So in this type of mission you can activate these things even if you have done a double move and that's exactly what we're gonna do. And now that these uh, boxes have been tagged then I no longer need to worry about them. Uh, we're gonna see if the sniper can take care of this lost. Boom! Great, nice shot. How about this? Nice, that's a nice five. And let's see if you can take care of this last guy. 
Can you still see him? Yep. So, kill. Is this the end of the mission? Nope. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna attack the boxes and get everyone ready. We're gonna make an overwatch shot and we're gonna take a cover here. Um, what's this? Ah, overwatch. Okay. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna make a tiny pause here. I'm gonna split this video in two and I'm gonna return in like 20 to 30 minutes. Uh, sorry that I had to plug this. See you soon. <laughs>